Hey guys, welcome back to Think Making. This is Anton, and today I'll show you how to get perfect bed adhesion when printing PLA. So let's get to it. Okay guys, this method will work when printing on glass, with or without a heated bed. If you do have one, all you need is hairspray. Try to get the strongest one you have. If you don't have a heated bed, then you'll also need either time or a heat gun. To prep the surface, if you have a heated bed, bring the temperature up to 60 degrees and spray the glass sheet with one even coat of hairspray. It should dry up immediately. If you don't have a heated bed, then there are two ways to prep the bed. You can either spray the bed, wait for it to dry and repeat the process again, or you can remove the glass from the bed and use a heat gun to speed up the drying process. The important thing here is to give it at least two good coats of hairspray. So PLA will stick very well on hairspray, but that's not all to bed adhesion. To get it right, you also need to make sure your bed is leveled correctly in order to have just enough squish on that first layer. Additionally, using brim in your slicer and decreasing fan speed on bottom layers will always increase your adhesion, especially if you're not using a heated bed. So that's all you need to know to get PLA to stick properly. I really like this method because you can print up to three times before needing to spray the bed again, which you can actually do without cleaning the previous coats. If you still don't have a heated bed, I strongly encourage you to get one. They're not expensive and they'll save you countless prints. If you don't know which one to get, I'll leave an Amazon link down in the description with a very good one. If this method didn't work for you, you might also want to try to experiment with different build surfaces, such as build tech or pay sheets. Either way, I'll link them down below along with any other materials you might need. Well guys, if you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a huge thumbs up and if you still haven't, support us by subscribing to the channel. Again, thanks for watching and see you in the next one.